It's beer o'clock on Real Craft Beer. We have a bottle of Tomislav dark beer by Arusko Pivovara. It's a Croatian beer. Here's a look at the bottle cap. Little dented. Let's get it open into a glass and see what we get. Here we go. Beer in the glass then. This is 7.3% ABV. So quite a strong beer. I'm at a Lab Baba Craft Brewery and they're bottling behind me. Hand bottling the beer. Or hand labeling the beer, should I say. And we're going to be pairing it with original Bobby. Some nice Croatian crisps. So, beer in the glass for 7.3% ABV. Dark beer, three finger, just off white head. Let's get the aroma. Oh, it's quite clear to look at as well. Quite clear. Aroma. Smells okay. This smell okay. Nicely roasted. Some nuttiness coming through. Let's dive in. Cheers. I really like the aroma, although the taste is very different from the aroma. It's um, it's a tough one. I was smelling roasted, nutty flavours, lots of biscuit, malt, and then the taste is it's somehow different. Just a little bit of plum. Um, a little bit roasted, nice and bitter. A little bit nutty, but not so the like the aroma was picking up. I thought I was going to be tasting a big nutty, biscuity, bready, almost like a, an imperial version of of the old-fashioned Newcastle brown ale which is another beer that's been ruined by mass beer. So this has been brewed by Heineken. Yeah. By Heineken. This is the first ever uh, industrial beer review in a craft brewery. Yeah, yeah, look at this. This is a prime beer in a, in a world ever. In a world, first. So Lots of stuff going on by hand behind us. Hand labeling the beer. The beer gets, the bottle gets hand capped. The beer is hand brewed behind us. This beer is probably all brewed by machines. Probably brewed by machines. Down to the capping, the labeling, the bottling, it's probably all done by machine. But it's not the worst beer I've ever tried. I've had far worse than this. This is actually okay. Here's a little bit of licorice, I like the carbonation, pushes the beer on the inside of the mouth. It's not bad, I've had, I've had much worse beers than this. Green bottle, not going to make too much difference because the beer is dark, the hops are not going to get infected by, not infected but get... I assume. No light strike going on because it's a dark beer. I'm gonna try it with the crisps. Try it with the crisps. Oh look, this is, um, they have a new beer coming out, look. This is the ingredients for the new beer. So uh, it's domestic potato. Potato so, beer. So since everybody's using corn and rice, why, why not? not? You get sugar from anything, yeah? <laughs> 
Right, what can you tell me very quickly about these uh, Bobby Croatian crisps? That's a peanut infused uh, flips and it's uh, something we all grew up with. It's very old, very traditional. Let's go. Let's try them. Peanut infused crisps. Never really took off in the UK. Whenever you go to Europe, you always see these crisps. I really like these. They're really oily on the finger. A really oily crisp, like peanut oil. And they're also, they're quite tacky. They're quite tacky to touch. There's a lot of peanut oil on these crisps. Yeah. But generally, yeah. This is sit back, relax, TV on, or internet on in the 21st century. Beer, dark beer, crisps. Not bad. Although, I don't think you could eat the whole bag. Already I'm like closing them up like whoa. They're quite heavy. I think you can you have can. to eat the whole bag, yeah? I think you can. Yeah? <laughs> Keep the energy up. <laughs> okay, original Bobby. Flips. Crisps. Goes very well with a beer. But the beer, Thomas Lav, I don't know. I'm I'm mixed about it. I'm really mixed. The aroma is really good. The look of the beer is really good. There's a little bit of a letdown in the follow-through. That 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 aroma, the look of the beer looks good. And then you taste the beer. And it's a little bit disappointed. I want more roasted malt, I want more nuttiness. But hey, it's mass-produced industry beer. What more can you expect? Let's rate it. I'm gonna rate this beer, I'm gonna give it... It's not the worst beer I've ever tried, it's not the best beer I've ever tried. I reckon it's worthy of a six out of 10. Six out of 10 from Real Ale Craft Beer. The Bobby Crisps, meanwhile, I like them. I'm gonna try and eat the whole bag. I'm gonna give them an eight. Eight out of 10 from Milo Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Thank you very much to the people who hosted me at Lab Craft Split Brewery. We finished bottling. We're doing our second run on the beer, on the stout that we brewed today. While I'm here, we brewed a collaboration stout together. Look out for it. It's called Simon's Engine Oil. Barber Split Simon's Engine Oil. Thanks for watching. Put your comments in the comments box. Please subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! And cheers.